What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So, you guys were hitting me up on Instagram, Twitter, and y'all were uh, even in the chat while we were live streaming on Twitch earlier today. Uh, Vince McMahon may be in trouble, man. Uh, this article is from BleacherReport.com, and there's a, a whole bunch of other sites talking about uh, Vince McMahon uh is uh in some hot water potentially so let's get right into this article vince mcmahon investigated by wwe board over three million dollars settlement payment let's see what's going on here with vince and what, what's happening here wwe chairman vince mcmahon is under investigation by the company's board regarding a reported three million dollar settlement he agreed to pay to a former employee with whom he allegedly has an affair according to the wall street journals joe uh, palazzo and ted mann per the wall street journal report the board's investigation which began in april has unearthed unearthed other older uh, non-disclosure agreements involving claims by former female WWE employees of misconduct by Mr. McMahon and one of his top executives, John Laurinaitis, the head of talent relations uh, at WWE. The people said the journal couldn't determine how many previous agreements were uh, were being scrutinized. A spokesperson. Uh, our spokesman for WWE told Palazzo and Man the company is cooperating full with the board, uh, the board inquiry, and that the relationship with the ex paralegal was consensual. Palazzo and Man reported members of the WWE board received anonymous emails de detailing the three million dollar payment, which was allegedly paid for by McMahon with his personal funds. The author of the emails who was a friend of the employee in uh, in question said the woman was first hired hired and given a $100,000 salary the friend said the woman's salary then rose to 200k after she started a sexual relationship with uh McMahon oh boy it's getting real spicy the emails also said the woman was so scared so she quit after Vince McMahon and the law, uh, lawyer Jerry uh, McDevitt paid her millions of dollars to shut up. McDevitt told the Wall Street Journal the woman didn't level any allegations of harassments against Vince McMahon or received a lump sum of money from WWE when she left. Financially, WWE's wealth has never been better. The company reported a record high revenue of $1.1 billion and and an operating income of 259 million from 2021 fiscal year. The revenue for the first quarter of 2022 was huge, 333.4 million, its highest ever for a single quarter. However, the Wall Street Journal reports comes amid a period of relative uncertainty surrounding wwe the company released a significant number of wrestlers across 2021 and the departures have continued into 2022 it doesn't appear to be a given either that another member of the mcmahon family will run wwe whenever vince who turns 77 in august steps down shane mcmahon is no longer employed with wwe stephanie mcmahon who's became WWE's chief brand officer in 2013, announced in May she was taking a leave of absence. Her husband retired star Triple H, underwent surgery following a cardiac event last September, and has seen his backstage duties reportedly change. The investigation of Vince McMahon could fuel more speculation about the long-term future of WWE. It makes sense. It makes sense. You'd be surprised how many people throw hush hush money at individuals. And I wouldn't be surprised if Vince pushed his weight towards certain women wrestlers or, uh, you know, people he had hired. And, you know, who's going to say no to Vince? So I'm guessing maybe something went down. She was initially hired, her, sal her salary went up an extra 100K potentially uh, for doing some extra favors for vince uh this is all allegedly and after that you know i guess the things you know i guess the person wasn't feeling it no more and wanted to you know wanted things to change and um i guess when she was about to leave they gave her some hush hush money 
I'm not gonna lie to you. That sounds plausible. That actually sounds believable. I know it's kind of messed up to say, but we're talking about Vince McMahon. Vince McMahon is a very powerful individual with a lot of money. His pockets run deep. And it's a situation where you're trying to take him to court unless you're somebody else with deep pockets. It's not even going to really work out for you in the end. You know, it's, it's kind of tough to take Vince to court and win. It is. So I don't know. This 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 definitely does sound plausible. And then it, it's like it's like it writes itself in a sense, because now all these years later, uh, the friend of the person is trying to out them out. And now the board is looking into it. So it's like the real question comes into play. Why wait so long to let it be known? Like, what's going on here if this is supposedly true? And I don't know. This It's just, it doesn't look good for optic-wise for Vince McMahon. If this is true, you had some sexual relations with someone. While you was having, means you were having an affair with your wife. You're having sexual relations with someone. You was increasing their pay because they were doing sexual things with you. And now... You know, it didn't end too well. Person tried to leave. Well, person did leave, and you basically wanted to pay them off to be quiet. It, you will be surprised how how often, you know, how this story actually plays out a lot more than you realize. It just is behind closed doors. I Hell, it can happen even at, you know, your local uh, office job. You'd be surprised somebody gets extra in incentives to do something for the boss or whatnot and they get extra pay and you know to keep them quiet they may give them some hush money is it right no it's not right and especially in the climate we in now where people are ready to cancel you at any moment and it definitely does not look good for for vince man so we will see how these things play out but if it comes out that he definitely did these things, paid off a woman for sexual favors while having an affair with his wife, it's not going to look too good. So, comment down below. I want to know, do y'all think Vince McMahon would do such things? Do y'all think he, you know, actually was a part of this whole situation? Or do y'all think this is just someone trying to, you know, ruin Vince McMahon's legacy or whatnot? Let me know down below, man. But I appreciate all the love and support. From the channel Road to 90K. Appreciate y'all kicking me. See y'all next one. Peace.